You guys, in today's episode, episode 9, we will be pretty much customizing the farm, giving it a little makeover. We're going to be probably, hopefully, being able to make a pond, placing down a bunch of trees, maybe a white picket fence. I don't know if we even have that in-game. But yeah, so I am on here. Again, I usually record these earlier in the morning, so nobody's on, but Farmer Nick is already working. So another thing that I found out this morning, just I don't know if you guys really care, but plant growth was actually off for about two days. And as you guys know, we were planting like this whole entire time. And uh, unfortunately, these fields already are ready to harvest, but then all these other ones were not, were not growing like whatsoever. They, the, our plant growth was completely off and i just found that out this morning i was like why aren't our plants growing and so i logged in as an admin i looked and it was off so i was able to fix that thank goodness and then i turned it on fast to, to try and make up with some of the lost time that we had anyway that kind of slows us down in everything but hopefully by tomorrow we uh i think it might be ready to harvest by tomorrow maybe maybe two days from now anyway today we will be placing down multiple trees so if we go to this is the only fence that we have, and it really doesn't look that good. I think I might hold off on it. Let's go to decorations. We can place that at a sand castle if we want. I don't know if I'm really going to do that. But uh, we have so many trees. We have an insane amount of trees. Kind of, I got to figure out exactly what we want to place down. Probably a lot of spruce mediums for our medium-sized trees. Uh, birch does look pretty cool as well, but these, these are also big trees. So that is the move today. We will be decorating the the farm and first thing let, let's place some trees first i'm thinking but we're going to be making a pond and i'm going to show you guys how to make a pond in farming simulator and there's a little catch to it i don't know how to do it in uh, any other map but this one so i don't know if i could help out with any other one so this is birch medium let's see how this looks here i gotta kind of ooh, that's pretty nice not bad not bad i gotta get used to all right we need some we need like a little shrub right here all right, that's decent. Oh, I wish there was like a bush. What is this thing, dude? This thing is huge. An alder, an alder. We'll just kind of place one in the backyard. Holy cow. That thing is not small. And I think we'll place another one here. So the main thing is we do want to, obviously, obviously we want to protect the farm. And a lot of times you guys see that with farms where they make like lines around pretty much around their sheds or their most protected spots that they want to protect which is their home so by the way guys we i guess i haven't even walked inside here yet uh we can sleep in here i think is this all we can get into there's our coat can we get in through this door oh yes we can we had to crouch very cool really nice kitchen uh can we go upstairs i actually oh my goodness i haven't visited this like ever okay anyway here, let's crouch through. It seems like when I crouch, I can make it through better. And there's our three trucks, and then Garrett's is in the garage right there. So I was thinking we are going to, for our blocking trees, I was thinking we'll do uh, the mediums here. Again, we can always sell these, like, right away. So let's see kind of how this looks. Ooh, that's not bad. And it looks like it's going to protect things very, very well. They are not humongous, but I don't want them to be too big. We'll put a decent amount of space in between them, and then we'll pretty much just make a line. So this is going to protect the house. The most important part, you always see it on farms, because obviously when you're in the country, it is like so windy. You're in the open. Obviously, I'm from the city, and it's it's not nearly as windy. Okay, that's going to do really good. Maybe I do in between here, but I feel like that's too much. And guys, this is not cheap. How much was that? That was $1,000. So we just spent nine grand in construction. At the end of this video, we might spend like fifty to a hundred thousand dollars giving our our farm kind of like a makeover. So let's. I do want to mark this off even more, and we can kind of spread these out more as well. It's more of the thought that counts, and hopefully by the end of this episode, our farm looks like insane. I'm so excited to have the pond here, uh, a few other things as well. All right, super important that we get this done here all right so obviously you guys see this always at farms you always see how the house is protected i might want to sell that tree right there and actually i am so let's go to the garage so i can sell any mistakes that i oh wait no no no, no. you can't sell trees 
Oh yeah, I forgot you can't sell trees. That's funny. Um, or it's not funny, but okay. Is this? That's fifteen hundred boys. This stuff is not cheap. Let's go to. Let's kind of jump around here. I do want. Okay, what tree is this? Was that our pine? Okay, that was birch. Birch big, I believe, is going to go right here. I believe, hopefully. And then, obviously, this is our main road. If you guys have been uh, watching on the other episodes, this is our main road to our farm. And I want to make this very decorative and make sure people know where to go and stuff. Place one kind of on the opposite side of these. These were actually already here. I believe, unless... Yeah, no, they're already here. Gonna place these. Yeah, guys, this stuff is not cheap. We're, I'm gonna spend about 100k. Hopefully, Artist Garrett and CJ are okay with this. I know they said that we wanted to we wanted to decorate this more. And so, hopefully... Yeah, hopefully, they're okay with this. Kind of make a path here. The biggest thing, obviously, is going to be our pond. But for now... Here, something very important. I want to place the biggest tree in the game. Oh my goodness, we just spent 18k right there. So when we pull in... So here we have two roads. We have one road over here and one road here. Now this pine big, how big is this thing? We... Uh, um, I'm not too familiar with how... Maybe we'll just go pine mediums for when they pull in. We can kind of pine extra large, pine big. Dude, that thing is insane. We'll just go pine mediums for the entrance. So that is our entrance. I do like the pines. They're very nice. Okay, we do also own all this land. So we can mow everything within, I believe. Wait, I think we own all this too. No. Yes. Okay, that's where it cuts off at, right? Okay, so guys, we own all this land, so I am not worried at all about taking up land, using land, especially for our pond. All this area is going to be used for expanding the farm in the future. We're going to place all, we're going to, we might end up doing cows as well, sheep. We might do all, all animals because that's, that's very fun. Anyway, let's keep going here. I might hold off for the tree. No, we should probably keep, keep it going. Should we place some? Some large pines. Dude, this thing's insane. We already, we've already spent so much money. Yeah, we should probably put more trees around here, though. So let's go to... Okay, so spruce is kind of our favorite one, but I do like birch. I do like birch a lot. Let's put a few over here. Two, three. We want to just kind of decorate our farm. If you guys... Here, let's go run over to... Squ this is Squad's farm. This is his entrance in here. Just trees galore. I don't know if I want to get that crazy with trees. I mean, that is hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of trees. Okay, so here are the pine bigs. These do look pretty good. Um, they actually don't offer that much wind protection. I, I guess they do, but not on the lower level. All right, let's go head back over here. How is ours looking? It's not. Maybe we should have a row of pine or excuse me, spruce bigs. Yeah, so let's do that here. I'm going to do a quick little time lapse here, guys, of me finishing up the trees. And hopefully you guys do enjoy. All right, so I think that is it for now in terms of trees. We did expand the kind of protective line all the way over here. And I feel like the spruce mediums or the spruce mediums are very good for that. And then I did give, excuse me, I did give Rocky some some shade as well. So in the, in the summertime, when it gets really hot, Rocky can come sit over this alder tree and these offer a bunch of shade and we have little trees as well. So he can kind of pee on the pee on the bottom of the tree or something like that. Anyway, we, uh, what do we need to do now? That's a good question. We, I was thinking about moving the transfer tank as well. We just need to, it's kind of in the way where I put it and let's see if we can just quickly move that. We will lose some money, but again, guys, this is yeah, it's only 4,000, and then let's see how much we can buy it for. So let's go to 
think it's in decor no it's in miscellaneous there it is all right we will lose like five thousand dollars but no worries and then it's gonna place this like right or is there a better spot there might be a better spot maybe put it by probably yeah let's put it right here i feel like this is a really good spot for it right next kind of to everything that looks really good right there and if we ever want to add a shed this isn't a bad like small little shed spot but anyway there we go i felt like the fuel tank was just in the way now oh my goodness this thing's huge now we can uh now we're gonna make a pond we're gonna make a pond this is gonna look really really cool it let's go to landscaping tool switch to landscaping or sculpting and i'm thinking we're gonna make it right here so kind of as you pull in we're gonna have a pond and you guys are probably wondering like special tv i've never heard of anybody making a pond in farm somewhere well this is so let me just kind of explain something real quick and I, I might test it somewhere no we're just gonna full send it right right here let me fly over to so who, somebody has a pond on this map now if you guys saw if you guys heard me saying how they trolled us okay that might be uh how they trolled us and then it uh there it is here's a pond so they just dug down and then there's water beneath this map so when you dig down water appears so i'm hoping when i sculpt down into the ground water will come up for us and uh yeah by the way their squads farm again all right so and i thought maybe putting the pond kind of by the entrance here would be kind of cool because we come down the road always so wish me luck here we go we're going in oh wait i'm going the wrong way come on where's the water oh there's water right there Okay, here, let me drop down real quick. Let's run over here to make sure everything is good so I don't do things too crazy. It didn't let me go that deep. I don't think it even does let you go that deep, which is fine. I don't really need to go that deep. I just want the water effect. All right, there's the water. It does seem like I have to go fairly deep, and it doesn't let me go any deeper. Hopefully, this works. I know some people were having troubles with it. Oops. um please let me go deeper come on train cannot be modified here why can't it be modified um it looks like the only water is like right here there we go i think we're getting into a better spot for it i think it's kind of touchy oh guys oh no why can't i modify the terrain what am i it's like it lets me for a second and then it doesn't anymore it looks like here's some water let me bump up the how do i increase the size so train to straight by left control q so now it's super powerful there we go yes okay now now we're working now we're come come on why why would it let me make a pond there yes come on let me do it let me make a pond there it worked there maybe we're gonna have a very small pond i hope we don't have to do that okay now it is working unfortunately it was not working like a second ago no 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 okay i can i can kind of build it back up to make it look normal again and yeah we're gonna have some losses here and again this isn't cheap this does cost kind of some money so that is unfortunate but let's see if we can fix some of this of course now i can kind of smooth it out and make it normal again but okay now we're gonna so this is our pond it's not Oh, dang it. I thought it was going to work there. No, 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 no. Why is this not letting me? Huh? Guys, I really have no idea why this is not working. I'm sorry. I promised something that I could not hold up to. Let me go ahead and smooth it out. And then I guess it's going to be more so like a koi pond rather than something that I was hoping would be much larger. That's unfortunate. I, I probably can try and make one somewhere else. 
But this is our only really like good spot. I was thinking about doing it. This is very unfortunate. No. At least let me smooth it out. Okay, I, I just wish I had an explanation. If anybody knows in the comment section, let me know why I can't. Why I can do it in some areas and other areas I can't. Um, and this is not going to work on if you are not on this Honeydew Farms map. So the the reason why this is working is because this is a uh, train cannot be modified here. All I want to do is paint it. All I want to do is paint it. Come on, let me tell me I can paint this. Please. All right, this ah, uh, that looks decent. I want to go on the bank, kind of make it like rocky, like a rocky bank, maybe. Come on, boy. There we go. Go around the sides here, guys. It's not going to be as good as I was hoping. Uh, at least we do have water now. Unfortunately, maybe artists and Garrett or CJ have some, a better idea for the pond. I hope they do because I kind of messed it up. But once again, comment section, let me know if anybody knows anything different on the terrain mod. The reason why water's coming up is because this is the this is the map that kind of lets it. Oh, that, that's not terrible. Um, maybe maybe put act like we have kind of rocks around the side, maybe with like a like this tool, this paint color. See how that looks? Not bad, not bad. To kind of act like we have maybe... Maybe do this color for... Here. And then... Ah, oh, maybe not. Maybe just go around it. Yeah, maybe we'll just go around it like this. I can always clean that up in there. So I'm, I'm just trying to add a few more things. Comment section, let me know what else I can add. It. It's so easy to add it. Um, any other textures or things you would like to see? Would dirt be a better color? I don't know. And uh, maybe this outline doesn't look good. Who knows? Oh, it's not bad. I just wish we could make this into, like, you wouldn't really have a, like, what is this right here? I don't know. It is kind of shallow looking. I'll switch back to that dirt texture and then there we go. There we go. Okay, I wish. Let's see if. Can I do it? Come on, give it to me. Come on, let me sculpt it down. It still doesn't. So uh, let's switch to maybe put some, some trees around it. Go to decorations again. Maybe a few spruce mediums need to be. Uh, I don't. Maybe a few spruce smalls. Oh, those are way too small. Birch big, maybe. And there we are. So that's our pond. Not my favorite. It's decent, I would say. Here, let's fly over real quick to the other pond. I wish we could make it like that. Comment section, let me know how I can. I think this... I think this pond was was man-made there's looks so much deeper look at that and it looks like really really good unfortunately i have no idea why it wasn't letting me modify the terrain but anyway hope you guys did enjoy today's episode that is it for for customizing here let me let me walk down on it i guess it's not it's not terrible it's not uh i'm not prefer it see it's so shallow you can like see the grass i guess that's the algae well, hope you guys did enjoy today's episode, and uh, I think we're probably going to start mowing here very shortly along with uh, we should be ready to plant. So even though it's in like the first or second stage of planting or of growing, we should be able to knock things out here. Hopefully you did enjoy again. Thank you for watching. I know I just said that like three times. I will see you all tomorrow and smash the like button if you did enjoy.